Kati Hughes, executive member of the Alliance for Change, is calling for an independent examination of the Child Care and Protection Agency, the Guyana Police Force, and all the other entities involved in the rape allegation probe involving former government minister Nigel Damlal. The allegation was made by a 16-year-old indigenous girl. Hughes was speaking at the party's press conference last Friday. Situation are examined in, by an independent group and de determination where we fell down, recommendations put on the table, implemented. The question that we should be asking is if the exact same situation, if tomorrow some other girl reports a similar situation with un other, another individual, and we've heard of other stories similar, are we as a country in a better position to defend the rights of the victim? And at the end of the day, if you look at the Sexual Offenses Act, where it specifically talks about ensuring that a victim doesn't have to regurgitate over and over and over what took place, how is it possible that you don't record the first time, the first statement, but the exit statement you're boasting that you recorded? Does that make sense? And on the day that she decides, no further action supposedly the third organization had come in for her to repeat again what took place three times in one day that cannot be acceptable damdal opted to resign as minister and member of parliament mere hours after the dpp advised the police that no charges are to be laid against Nigel Damlal, the then local government and regional development minister, following the withdrawal of the statement by the complainant. 